You know, my special interest developed um, during my training. These women that face breast cancer, I find very courageous. They always inspire me. And I think that breast cancer is a much different cancer than other cancers because there's such an emotional and physical component to it. So I developed a special interest simply from the bravery that these women have during their fight against the breast cancer. Also, if it's caught early, it really is a treatable disease. So I'm really proud of the accreditation that we received at Kaiser San Rafael because it provides our patients with a level of confidence in the care they're receiving for breast cancer. And it promoted a cohesiveness among the multidisciplines in providing that care. Well, Dr. Anderson really had the idea to seek out accreditation. We've always had a, a breast center and the accreditation process just enabled us to raise the bar for already doing excellent work, but to make it even more superior. I've really been proud to be part of the uh, Breast Care uh, uh, Steering Committee. We've done a number of things through the steering committee. We have our daily one-stop breast clinic uh, where women with a palpable lump can get all their imaging done, followed by a physical examination by the surgeon and biopsy the same day. Uh, in the past, it would be several visits to the medical center for the patients, sometimes over weeks or days, and it was very anxiety-provoking for the patients and their families. Um, now we're able, with some women with benign findings, immediately to reassure them that everything's okay, or women that have more suspicious findings, um, we can get them immediately into uh, treatment and uh, support for them. If you look at a breast cancer diagnosis as navigating through sort of rough, uncharted waters, the patient navigator or the breast care coordinator, in, in my case, allows me to put up buoys throughout those waters and it's a place for people to rest or to, you know, have some respite and some comfort as they're navigating. And it's an accompaniment type of position. So I get to sort of walk hand in hand with our patients through their, their journey through breast cancer and, and into survivorship. To be chosen for the Hal Brown Shining Star Award, to me, uh, I, I'm really touched that my colleagues nominated me. I feel very honored that they felt the work I initiated deserved you know, a nomination. But certainly being honored with the whole team, I think is what's really appropriate because it was such a group effort to achieve the accreditation at our center. <laughs>